my name is Eileen Perez, and this is what happens to anything a black hole swallows. So first of all, things don't get fully swallowed by a black hole. Let's first talk about what a black hole really does. So here we have our singularity, which is a very, very massive remnant of a star. So after a very massive star has died, it has imploded into a zero volume, almost a point-like feature that is very, very massive. So massive that its own light has been sucked in. Now, uh, the other thing that we need to know is the event horizon. And the event horizon is pretty much the point of no return. If you have crossed the event horizon, you're going to stay gravitationally bound to that black hole. Now, what do black holes generally swallow? So generally, like when you see a black hole, that stuff is falling into a black hole is because it had a binary system. So sometimes stars come in pairs. So you have a star one and star two. And then one dies and becomes a black hole. And you end up in this situation where you have a really nearby star next to the black hole. So what's happening with this star? It's feeling the gravitational pull of the black hole and some of its material is going to start to slowly move towards the black hole. And is what mostly is going to happen is that it's going to circle around the black hole and it's going to form something called the accretion disk. And this is how we detect most black holes. We see this accretion disk leaving the star. We know there is a black hole there who's swallowing something. So actually, most things don't ever go into the black hole. They just circle around forever. The things that go into the black hole are things that lose momentum. So they lose the energy to keep circling, to keep orbiting that black hole. What happens with anything that falls in is that it gets superheated. And what happens when you get superheated is that the black hole starts ejecting this really, really massive X-ray jet. So you'll see this really massive X-ray emission and we see the, the we can detect this pulsation, it's just these jets that come out of the top and bottom of accretion disk. So anything that is swallowed by a black hole gets superheated and released in forms of X-rays. And that's what happens to things that are swallowed by a black hole. My name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist.